Hey, Orange One here. So we are back in the um, in the lab. I I don't know how much more of the lab we have to go, but I think um, we're gonna be doing a little bit more diving. We do have our thermal electric outfit. We do have also a scarf and some other stuff kind of to help us out with a little bit of that temperature management. But we have you know primarily our gun and um, ammo for said gun. To defend ourselves and we've been trying to just kind of clear things out and go deep down and try and, and get to the finale around here so we got a juggernaut right there that's interesting um yeah let's just take them out it's gonna be kind of loud so there we go that's better I and mean, actually you can still hear the gun but it's actually a lot lot quieter that's kind of interesting I like that. And if he's just gonna stand there and like pick his nose, I don't even know what they're doing. I'll, uh, I'll gladly take him out from a distance. As we've established, there's tons of bullets right around here. Um, oh, that's strange. It looks like I haven't reloaded my gun. Well, Dag Nabbit, I'll have to take care of that. Um,. Yeah, we don't have very many shots left. Okay, well, let's see. Where were... I think we have, like, some bullets somewhere around here. 50 cal turret there, another turret there. Bullets up there. Okay. So let's go up to those. We actually might want to just make a little pit stop right here. Just warm up. For free, right? Why, am I, why not? Uh, it's free heat, which is essentially our limiting reactant. In ex exploration right now so we kind of need to go up I think and over and if you check this out this is essentially the path that we're gonna need to kind of clear out for deep diving through here oh we're straining okay I think it's because we're chilly and when you're chilly you move even slower and weaker so let's just kind of warm ourselves up just for a little bit Get that chilly to comfortable. Maybe even get that to warm, because that might give us a little bit of extra time. Eh, maybe it's not gonna get to warm. Whatever. Let's let's just get our ourselves up here. Yep, there we go. That's kinda out of the way. And then, there we go. So we're kind of, we've kind of cleared out a path. Let's take those earplugs out so we can actually hear things. And then uh, there was, and there's the stairs right there. That's just our left. Yeah. Okay. I'm trying to move this counter there we go just so we've got something to indicate oh yeah hey this is something kind of weird over here right okay so then there's this and we kind of came through here and there's there should be some bullets somewhere around here yeah what go through here yeah i think it's like yep here we go beautiful we even got our drum mag loaded up. Uh, okay, well, let's actually switch that out then with said drum mag. And it's got those other ones stashed away. Cool. Alright, so we got all the ammo stashed away there. Uh, why are we so low on power there? Did we get, like, EMP blasted? I think that must be what happened. Okay, whatever. We're yep, EMP blasts are draining my power. There's something on around there that's just wrecking our power. That's really unfortunate. Okay, whatever. It's a uh, oh, hello. Where did you come from? Oh, you got quite a bit of health there, buddy. I think you need to, you need to just take a chill pill, mate. 
Uh, what do we have up here? We got a little little break for ourselves. A little rest. Cool. Okay, well, let's see. What do we have? We got tons of bullets. I just kind of wanted to get give ourselves a minute to breathe. Oh, wait. Okay. Yep. I guess we can go close the door and prevent the enemy from coming through, which is uh, definitely what I'm going to do. Got that stand on my back. Hello. Let's get you up here. Yeah, these guys are kind of slow. They're not really even that concerning for me at this point. Okay, cool. So that Kevlar is down. I kind of want to check these crates out. Because I don't think we have. Yeah. We haven't really done that yet. Oh, look. There's some battery power for us. Just got to live off the land, right? Yep. Thank you. And then... I don't have the empty... I, I left it there. Yeah, good. Okay, cool. And then what is this right here? Cranial flashlight? Yeah, I was talking about possibly getting that installed. Another thing that I was uh, thinking about was possibly... Um, getting like a little generator down in the tunnel, but I don't think we're going to really want to stay here that long but it is something that you can do pretty effectively um oh that's that's a good amount of power right there to make like a little base is basically what i'm thinking like if you had like a nice little like um science lab base it'd be good okay so we could actually do like a little operation here we, we'd get pretty cold without the thing powered, but we could do actually an operation even with it powered. That is something we could do. Oh man, I really want to update the game, but I just don't think it's going to work with this character. Come on, there we go. I think that this is... Is this how we went down last time? No, this is not how I went down last time. Okay, well, cool. What do we have here? Okay, just like a boring room. Hello, there you are. Okay, you're pretty much dead. Nice, okay. See, that wasn't so bad. There's some sort of something around here, though, that... Oh, there's another Juggernaut. I need to take out the Juggernauts, though, because they could uh, unleash, like, a Shogoth. And that we really don't want to deal with. If you think these guys are bad. Wait till we got a Shogoth. There we go. Um, yep, let's just uh, sneak on up there. Excuse me, pardon me. Thank you. Oh, there's even a spitter up here. Wow. Okay. I don't think I can easily get to them from here, though. Okay, let's maybe an angle our way up, like, through the actual doors. Oh, look, there's a Kevlar Hulk as well. Hello. Yeah, these guys are all over. What? What is that? Purifier. Okay, let's, uh, let's not shoot around the purifier. I'd rather not. Well, this whole, like, level's been kind of cleared out. You know? Let's go auto. We are starting to do some damage, but <laughs> we just emptied out the drum mag. Oh, nothing to close. Okay. There's another downstairs right there. We could go even further down. But I'm a little bit worried about how cold we're getting down here. Because they're zombies. They don't get slowed as much by the cold. Yeah, if we get 
if we go from chilly to very cold, we could be in trouble. Because look how fast he is compared to me. Let's get the uh, the joint servos going. Yeah, we're pretty much out of um, bullets as well with this round. Look at this. So it's. I I will kill it. I'm I'm not worried so much about that. Oh, actually, nice. We just push those things out of the way. If that if that holds it, then we're good. Yeah, I think that we're good. Let's just get our stand with us so we don't have that annoying thing going. Hello. There we go. <laughs> that was kind of a gamble there. Okay, so uh, those guys are dead. I just want to make sure that they're all pulped, and then I might just go warm ourselves up. I think that's probably a good call, right? Uh, should I get the purifier? No, let's go. Yeah, no, look, we're very cold. That's very bad. You don't want to be very cold in this game. Okay, um... Oh look, there's a harmonica! <laughs> How cute! Okay, we're not very cold now, that's good, because we were starting to get hurt by how cold we were. Let's just, uh, let's just go up a few levels. Is this where the tunnel entrance is? Or is that, um, the one that we were just up at? I think it was this one, right? Is this where the tunnel is? Yes, it is. Okay. Let's go down here. Just because it's a little bit closer than the actual service. And I want to just make sure that we can navigate our way back. Okay, we're actually almost out of that. Uh, let's just turn that off and just wait for a couple minutes. Poof. Uh, does that mean... Um, what I think it means. I think that means that we got fungals. Which could be nasty. I, I need to keep an eye on our uh, energy as well. Okay, so those guys are down. Is this gonna be the finale down here? If it's not, like, I don't know how much further we can go, honestly, because... All right, this is a cold lab. You start you start getting limited by the temperature. Like, um, it's negative ninety seven degrees Fahrenheit right now. Like, oh my god. You know what I mean? That's crazy. Let's see. Uh, we're just gonna run around and see what we can find in these rooms. Just really quick. We're going to freeze really, really soon. That's why we're running around. I'm going to just go back up to the surface. This is like insane how cool this is, honestly. Okay, we don't need to run quite so much now. Let's just kind of get ourselves a much more reasonable temperature. Oh my goodness. See, we're still chilly. Maybe we should get more bullets. And we kind of used a lot of them. Right? Yeah, let's go get more bullets. I'm, I think that... Uh... Oh, we're already chilly. That didn't last long. Yeah, let's, uh, let's go back up here. And then the bullets were from, like... Where was it again? Yeah, it's right here. There we go. See, I'm starting to learn. It's like a trail of bullets, right? Oh no, that's the uh, the upstairs, upstairs. Not quite what we wanted. Um, and we're gonna need to drop off a battery soon anyways, actually. Yep, there we go, that's all taken care of. Oh yeah, check this out. I also made myself a little sorbet and tea. 
The tea is still warm. I want to see how fast the thermos uh, would cool down. Going down to like the depths, you know? Going like real deep in here. It seems it seems like it's uh, held up pretty well there. I mean, going down to negative 97 degrees. I mean, a thermos in real life would actually hold up just fine. So. It's good that they've got that working in that regard. Okay, let's see what else we can find in these depths. Actually start running down. Um, yeah, we'll get, keep the joint servo going. And let's try... What is that right there? Grim Howler. Yeah, I thought it was just a Grim Howler. That's not like a real enemy. Let's go ahead and let's just stop running quite as much. Yeah, it's nothing. Have a peek in there. Nothing. Just ammonia. Yeah, see, it's like all mutagen ingredients, but I'm not getting the actual books. Which is a shame. Because we really do need the books. Okay. Yeah, I think we're going to need some more uh, proper clothes. Oh, a man hack. Does that mean there's like a zombie scientist around here or something? Like, uh, what? That was just uh, a rogue, rogue man hack? No such thing. Okay, let's, uh, let's try and loop around like this way. Oh, there's some crates. That has some promise. Okay, bedrooms. That's not what we're here for. Another level down. Jesus. In a suit, a briefcase. Okay, well. Dang. Uh, there's something up there making a ruckus. I don't like that. Uh, that's just, um. We're very cold. We're gonna start hurting. Yeah, so we need to just get up. This is this is insane. Like how cold this is. Okay, get out of here, please. And we're out. Good. Nice. Um. Can I just actually replace that battery here? We'll go with the high capacity. We'll just wait for a minute. Yeah, I think that honestly, this is this is kind of like reminding me of the early game for me because um, I or not early game, but the game like years ago because when I was playing this game, oh that's that's still running. Whoops, whatever. When I was originally playing this game, um, like more than half the labs were cold labs. Now it's a lot less. I think it's like maybe a quarter of them or something. It's significantly less, in any case. And I, I like that because labs, they're fun. Ice labs, not so fun. <laughs> um, a barracks. Okay, never mind. I honestly was not that interested in a barracks because I have tons of bullets, as we have established. There are zombies in here. That's pretty clear to me. Uh, there's a turret there. I oh, know there's there's not zombies. It's just a blob. I think we can we can take out the turret with our tried and true method of being uh, as some would call a son of a gun. Okay, there's an actual blob here. Oh, let's take aim. Actually, I want to take this one out. Oh my gosh. They're tough little blobs, these guys. I mean, I'm, I'm about to kill a turret is the thing, so it's kind of like whatever, you know? Yeah, come on closer, man. There we go. All right. So, if I turn that off... Yeah, that's good. 
Now I'm going to open that and I'm going to toss my flashlight. Um, actually, hold on. Yeah, never mind. This is kind of not a good idea. Actually, no. I, if I go there, I might be able to not be spotted by it. Yes. Okay, cool. All right, uh, that was pretty nice positioning. Um, yep. I can shoot it from here. Yep, let's do that. Nice. All right, turret is down. Easy. I don't want to stay here too long though. There were some zombies that were around. Okay, anesthetic. Alright, so this is like a CBM place then. Uh, there's something that's smoking in there. Not good. I don't want to find out. Uh, okay, we are gonna be very cold very soon. I think this is like the cafeteria room, right? Yeah, this is the cafeteria. We don't want a cafeteria. What is this? A library. That I am interested in. Okay. Um, can I actually just... Okay, we actually are reloaded. Cool. Um, nope, nothing. Japanese armor making. We can make a katana from that. Historic weaponsmith. That also is a half-decent book. We gotta get out of here, though. Alright, yeah, um, where's the Japanese one? I kind of want that. Please let it not be my downfall. Get this going. I mean, I know I can come back for it, is the thing. <sighs> okay, fine. We'll take that one. Get the other one another time. We need to get out of here. Let's just go the most direct path. I'm suddenly feeling numb. Well, I mean, that could be the fact that I'm freezing. Struggle to stand. Um, that's not good. Let's see, where is it that we're trying to go right there? Okay, let's go. Uh-oh, we're starting to fall. Can I get this going, please? Yeah, we need to just... Get up. Oh, our strength is four. That's not good. Feeling dizzy. Okay, we're not sensory doling and trying to repair, are we? No, we're not. Okay, we're good. I think that we're fine. We'll we'll make it out of this. Our dexterity is zero though. We really can't kind of push it that time. Uh, we don't really need that on anymore. Yeah, I know. Ouchie. Ouchie. Quite a bit. <laughs> Whoops. Um, maybe let's, uh, let's just, you know, read this by the light of that. Okay, cool. I mean, it's, it's not a bad book. There's some really cool stuff that you can make from it. Just kind of want the other one because I don't think we can make a katana. I kind of want to go full on Weibo, Weibo. I mean, that's what my other character, my last character was. Oh, we still have that adrenaline rush. Maybe we should wait for that adrenaline to come down. Let's just wait for that to be done. It's a, it's a really annoying effect to have on you and try and explore with. But let's try a little bit deeper now. We're just gonna go that, and then what way do I want to go? And the library has that book that I kind of wanted. Yeah, why don't we go for the book, and then we could also kind of push up and over. I think I got a semi-decent idea of our limits. 
I'm just gonna run just a little bit, just so that we don't freeze to death, you know? But not like the entire time, let's stop running. Get our breath back a little bit. Where's the Japanese armor making book? I know I saw it. Right? Am I crazy? Or did I see it? I mean, there's the Chinese one right there. I guess I'm crazy. Pretty strange. Okay. Alright then. Um, we're going to... Oh, there's a medbox interchange CBM. I think that's actually not that rare. Okay, whatever. We know that book that I wanted is not... Oh my gosh, really? This is insane. What CBM do we have there? Eh. Oh, cleave pouches. I kind of want that. I mean, honestly, I have a lot of autoclave pouches, so there's no real need for me to get it. But I think that we're going to need to head back soon. Let's just run over. Yeah, there's another way down right there. This is insane. It's like positively insane. Okay. North, I'm hearing screams of pain. Okay, that's the cyborgs. Sorry, guys. That's unfortunate. Oh, now we are very cold. Oh, diamond cornea. That's actually a really good one. Let's come back for it. We'll come back for it. We gotta not freeze to death. That was not good last time. Oh, look, we're actually kind of a little bit low on power. So how do I want to get back? Um, it's just straight over here. Okay, cool. This is like honestly like brutal trying to explore this area. Like seriously, like brutal, brutal. We are very cold and now we are good. Jesus. Okay. I might want to also unload things a little bit. Um, the C4 I've been carrying around just because it might be nice to be able to blow through a door if we need to, you know? Uh, that is empty, essentially. Um, yeah, I think that that's probably good for now. See if we're if we're doing it like that, then it doesn't take that long to uh, essentially recover, you know. It takes like five-ish minutes. Really? Okay, a little bit more than five minutes, like fifteen-ish minutes. Not too bad. Not too bad for diving into endgame territory loot. Now the thing is, is if there's another level down. We go down here and then here. Wasn't where's that nearest way down as well? From here there's uh there's one right there, which is pretty close. There was that bionic the di diamond cornea which I am interested in because I think that makes you have like super good vision. I'm pretty sure. Now if this doesn't work for us I'm not sure what I'm gonna do because uh, this is kind of a dangerous maneuver here. What we're trying to do. If the machine comes down, uh oh, I'm dead tired. Oh, hold on. Sorry about that. Uh, uh oh, we got shocked. We're gonna try another time. Cool, okay, good. Can I have a little look-see? <gasps> Diamond cornea, yes. Okay, that is what I wanted. I'll take that. What else do we have around here? I'm just curious. And others I, I'm not too interested in. 
Um, I think that we need to head up and out from here. I think I'm gonna um, probably end this though pretty soon. Let's see. Yeah. Let's try and get out of here. Okay. We're good. We're totally fine. See what I mean? Like, easy. Totally easy if you just do little trips. We might even have our character just sleep here, to be honest. Um, there's just, like, so much good stuff for us to get, you know? Uh, let's see. Right here. Just put that down. And I could just go through with the crowbar and, and try and break that out a little bit. All right, I think I'm going to end this here, and then I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.